going on guys? I'm Josh Killer here, back at it again with another Call of Duty World War II video. And I'll just go ahead, jump right into today's topic. Because this is honestly really, 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 really important. Everybody was waiting for news about a Modern Warfare 2 Remastered. Everybody was all excited. Everybody was really hype. And Activision ruined it. Actually, they never even confirmed it yet, but if it's true, they ruined it. They destroyed our hopes, they destroyed our dreams. Charlie Intel has released a leak saying that they have a source, and now everybody trusts Charlie Intel, but they're saying they have a source saying Modern Warfare 2 will have no multiplayer. It will be only remastering the campaign. Why? Think about it. Think about it. That doesn't even make any sense. Activision is money hungry. What will bring in sales? Multiplayer. Everybody plays multiplayer. You put days and days into multiplayer. People only play campaign for five hours. You know the story. The gameplay's not that fun, and you stop playing it. Besides the fact, Modern Warfare 2 had the most controversial campaign ever. If anybody remembers the mission No Russian, let me just explain it to you if you don't. Basically, No Russian was a mission where you have to go with the main villain, Makarov, and you basically go shoot up civilians in an airport. Now, that was one of the most controversial things, and it's even going to be more controversial here in 2018 with all the school shootings going on. I actually made a video about Trump saying video games um, are bad for teenagers with all the violence in them. So why would you remaster a mission? where you're going to be shooting up an airport. So that really doesn't make any sense for them to remaster the campaign and not remaster the multiplayer because everybody loves the multiplayer anyways and your campaign was the most controversial. No offense to the campaign. That was my absolute favorite campaign ever in Call of Duty. I actually haven't played the Call of Duty World War II campaign so I actually still need to play it to see if it beats Modern Warfare 2's campaign but I doubt it. It just I don't want to spoil anything but if you never played Modern Warfare 2 campaign you should buy it and remaster it if it's only a campaign because it was still amazing for a campaign. The Modern Warfare series as a whole for the campaign was amazing, but multiplayer is what brings in the big bucks. It's what it's a top dog. It, it's just multiplayer. Let's just put it this way: multiplayer is the best experience you will ever get from a video game. Now I know that's my opinion, but a lot of people feel the same way. Honestly, multiplayer is what makes Call of Duty. Nobody really plays campaign, and if you do play campaign, you play it, you beat it really doesn't have much of a replay value you go straight into multiplayer or zombies and you play the crap out of that and that's what brings in the big bucks for call of duty so why would you not remaster the multiplayer and honestly i'm not gonna lie i was really looking forward to spec ops and they said campaign only which means there wouldn't be spec ops either but i really love spec ops spec ops um if you don't know what it was it's basically a whole bunch of side missions if um you could complete it on different difficulties um i think it was like recruit hardened and veteran so you gotta play it on veteran to get the three stars and basically everybody grinded out to try and get the all of the stars throughout all the spec op missions it was honestly a lot of fun i remember playing it with my cousins back in the day it was super fun but you know we were grinding for those three stars <laughs> it was one of my favorite memories of playing video games especially back in the day because um, modern warfare 2 was actually the very first call of duty game i ever played i didn't play online multiplayer all that much whenever it first came up but i was playing a lot of local play with my cousins and then playing spec op and I played the campaign so overall it was an amazing game why would you only remaster the campaign but now hang on now let's get this let's get this if you made it this far into the video you're lucky if you clicked away oh well you missed out because think about this April Fool's is just around the corner it's coming up in a few days what if this is an April Fool's prank now this is really cruel if it is but if it is an April Fool's prank it was very well planned out um, even though a lot of people are gonna be ticked off but it would also bring a lot of relief. But if it was just the April Fool's prank, haha, you got us. But if not, a lot of people aren't going to buy the game. People are already putting down in comments and people making videos like this. Um, I'm not buying Call of Duty um, Modern Warfare 2 Remastered if it's only campaign. I wanted to play the multiplayer. It, it, it's going to ruin your sales. Um, I don't know if they would remaster it maybe within another year release a campaign a year later release just a multiplayer I have no idea but nobody's gonna buy the campaign I already played the campaign I just don't want to play a campaign with polished up graphics that I already played it's the same story why would I want to great campaign but it doesn't have the best replay value so I'm sorry you're gonna ruin your sales if oh yeah here's a big thing they're gonna ruin their sales but apparently Charlie Intel also says 
Raven Software, the people that made Modern Warfare Remastered, they also made a they like side produced with some other Call of Duty games. But apparently, they're not making this Modern Warfare 2 Remastered, which is kind of surprising since they made Modern Warfare Remastered, the original Modern Warfare. So uh, there's just so many leaks, so many rumors, and Activision is completely quiet. They're not saying nothing, which is honestly really irritating because I'm trying to get as much information. And they're staying quiet, and it's really frustrating for everything that's going on right now in the Call of Duty community. But drop down in the comment section below if you would even try and buy it, if it's only a campaign only. If you didn't play the campaign, like if you're new to the Call of Duty series and you never played a campaign, I would highly re recommend it. But if you already played the campaign, put it down in the comment section below if you agree with me. If you would not buy the campaign either, if it was only campaign. But... Basically, that's all I have for today, guys. That's all the news and information from Modern Warfare True Remaster. Let's just hope it's a prank. And this has been Josh Killer. That's all I have for today. And peace out.